Guys, please make sure you stay until the end. One common mistake that people often make can cost you thousands of dollars in repairs parts, diagnostics that you may actually not even need. Stay with us, we'll explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video, guys. If you have a Chevy Tahoe or Chevy Suburban, that generation here from year 2014 to year 2020. If one of your headlights is out, the headlight is not working, and you wonder what can cause that, guys, what we see quite often in the garage, how we can fix it, where we can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays with a good price, quick shipping, that way do not waste money and time. Why, guys? It's always a good idea to test fuses and relays all that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience please make sure it's there until the end so before we start guys let us tell you a little bit about us every single car we get here in the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them guys completely apart we show you how to fix engines transmissions bodywork guys engine codes transmission codes fuses relays uh, as well guys why we do all that because our mission in the shop is to save as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these free videos guys we have more than 15,000 free repair videos on our YouTube channels that can save you thousands of dollars in future repairs and if you guys need to buy any parts to use at a good price quick shipping that way do not waste money and time we'll put the link in the description of the video below for your convenience please check it out so guys if one of the headlights is out headlight is not working what can cause that multiple things guys but uh, the first thing you always want to check your fuses especially if you replace the bulb still doesn't work always check your fuses it could be very simple fix it should work on both Chevy Tahoe and Chevy Suburban both vehicles are built on the same platform and quick reminder guys 9 out of 10 people do not know that there is up to 5 different fuse boxes in that SUV that's why we made a special video on our YouTube channel it's called Chevy Tahoe Chevy Suburban fuse box location and diagram go ahead and open the hood when you open the hood facing the engine on the right side here on the driver's side you have a fuse box open that cover and you're going to find a fuse box with a layout like this one here before we guys continue let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below so guys which fuses and relays we need to check we're going to come in that section right here let me zoom in a little bit so you can clearly see the first fuse that you need to check we're talking about fuse 95 that double 10 amp fuse that's called micro three blade fuse they're hard to find and really overpriced we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can get replacement ones from another one that you need to check is fuse 121 that's for hid headlights and 122 one is for the left one is for the right side this 20 amp fuse now about guys relays there are specifically no relays here but on the bottom of your fuse box if you take it apart on the bottom side you have integrated relays that are not serviceable it's likely you have a relay there now other things that can cause it guys okay could be a bad bulb bad headlight bulb now the headlight bulb if it goes out you need to buy exactly the same kind make sure that you plug it in correctly uh, sometimes they look identical but if it's different part number it may not work especially if it's the hid bulb guys make sure you get the correct one another thing the connector behind the headlight you need to make sure that it's connected all the way and the one for the bulb as well sometimes people will have limited access and they will not install them correctly that can cause it not to work too when you replace a bulb never touch the glass part with your fingers the oil from your fingers will cause the bulb to burn prematurely guys because it will heat up fast at that spot 
Another thing, if you have HID headlights, it could be bad module. That can cause the headlight not to work. We've seen that happen too. But hopefully just a bad fuse or a bad bulb, that will be the easiest thing. Another thing, if both headlights do not work, it's very likely that it's a headlight switch. If it's just one headlight not working, it's not a headlight switch. If it, the headlight switch, it will not turn both of them on at the same time. So guys, I want to show you now something. Okay, check this thing out. You have all different kinds of fuses. Fuses, relays, circuit breakers, something that could be really hard to find. And if you're in the middle of nowhere, you don't have a replacement one, you may end up being stuck guys in the middle of nowhere or they can be seriously overpriced. So what we do, we usually buy some spare ones. We put in the glove box for a peace of mind. We'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get them at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you guys next time.